find random again. Victory and glory. Celts and salt marsh again, really. Lols. Maybe it bugs because we click salt marsh first and then switch to blind random. Rob Wigger. Rob Wigger. Why am I checking that one out? Yeah, it says salt marsh. Which is impressive. Luck or not luck. I really hate the, the input lag when I'm trying to set the you know hotkeys? Like you can see like I'll click on them and then have to come back because I haven't hotkeyed them properly. Oh god does that frustrate me so much. And I think my main mistake with trying to go water last game was you can't really exert much pressure with water control on this map I don't think. Because, like, just looking at that one, we both had fairly back resources. Which makes it, you can't really, like, raid them or anything with galleys, it's nothing, like, except for his berries. Everything else is fairly safe, and... Oh, fuck off. If he'd, um... Set up his eco correctly and, like, farmed properly and everything. Then that shouldn't have been too big of an issue. I wouldn't think. Um, I think Man at Arms is the name of the game today. And we're gonna do the loom again. Oh, you've lost sight of the boar, so you can't hunt it anymore? Is that how it is? Oh, you can go collect those turkeys. Oh, you can collect one of those turkeys. Oh, or you can not. The, the big berry bush is kind of nice. It certainly makes builds a lot. A lot more simpler, I think. Oh shit, no, don't run away. I don't want them to. Don't want them to kill another turkey. But yeah, okay, so, man and arms, shit, I'm about to get housed. So yeah, I should have housed with that guy instead of getting. Turkey for a normal build order. The way I usually do man arms. At least. Okay, it's not too bad. And like that loss of wood production there isn't gonna kill me. Because, you know, Celts. Alright, so he's over on this side. Nope, no, you're not the hunter. You're the hunter. Kia, 
I don't want to die to TC. Scanning is important. And then the last two bills will go to wood. Ah, because of that back goal, I'm thinking forward bill over here and get tower up on those two. I'll have to wait and see where the rest of his resources are, but... That's what I'm thinking. Like, it depends where his other golds are, mostly. There we are, and we're up. Alright, so there's other goals over on that side. I need to put two more hills on. Oh, no, uh -oh. Yeah, I've got my HD hookies are. That's not a problem. I'm thinking I'm going to go FC now. Sorry I'm not talking a lot. I'm not really used to this whole talking and casting and playing shindig. Rob 
I really need to change the other point. First, not, not really working out for him. Tower, go tower, get him, get him. So then I think my next tower is going to have to walk around that way a bit. And at this side I need to build. Come on, out you go. Useful if I built buildings, right? Oh, I'd be sneaky for him to come up and tell me. Let's just do a careful tower. Sure, I haven't done horse color. Alright, it's obviously going to be on this gold. I did not mean to do the, the rude single G. 
very unintentional. Oh, well, that's that's two games. Well played to Dutch class. I think it's a little bit unfair to him, seeing as I um, well, I think it was 300 Elo better by HD rankings. Um, I think his over reliance on scouts really hurt him because. I hurt my eco a little bit, chucking up a bunch of spearmen, but then he just wasn't really able to do anything to me. Whereas he's invested in what, maybe seven, eight scouts, that's 300, 400 food maybe, and I've got six spears. Like these will still be useful in Castle Age if he goes knights. Like three or four spears can gangbang a knight if they have to. But, anyways, all over. Um, yeah, did you feel played? Yeah, I think it's definitely got too much idle time is view late to do scouts. He's about a minute late. Like, even I'm 20 seconds late, but he's a minute late on doing scouts. Which, by the time I'm already at his base of man-at-arms, then he seems to be a minute at home. Anyways, GG's.